You're listening to Catholic Express, the daily podcast for Catholic kids that strives to plant seeds of faith. Hey there, Sprouts. Today is Tuesday, October 27th, 2020. This week on the Catholic Sprouts podcast, we are talking about the baptism of Jesus Christ that started his public ministry. Yesterday, we read from scripture, from the book of Matthew, the story of the baptism. And today we're going to go back and do some details to help us understand this story even better. So first things first, let's talk about the setting. Now, we know that this took place in the Jordan River, but as you can imagine, the Jordan River is very long. The place in particular in the Jordan River where John was baptizing was opposite of the city of Jericho. Jericho is a very interesting city. And what I want you to realize as we study the life of Jesus Christ is that nothing is a coincidence. We can look at a place and its history or even the details of a story that might seem unimportant, but everything in scripture is important. So let's talk about the city of Jericho. Well, Jericho happens to be perhaps the oldest city on earth, super old, way back when people were nomadic, meaning they didn't settle down. They kind of were hunter and gatherers. The very first place on earth that they planted crops and built houses and stayed was Jericho. And the reason why they did that is because As we talked about last week, this area of Judea is kind of a rough desert, very dry, crops don't grow there, big cliffs. But in Jericho, there was a natural spring. So it it was truly an oasis in the desert, this strange little area of lush, lush water and crops Uh, surrounded by dry, harsh desert. So that's why people first settled there. And that's why as the centuries went on, this was an important city. In fact, after God leads the people through the desert, through the the Israelites through the desert, after they've escaped slavery in, in Egypt, one of the first places that he directs Joshua to attack and conquer is the city of Jericho. And Jericho was surrounded by walls. It's a great story. If you want a great action packed story of how God mostly through peaceful means had them march around the city walls many days in a row. Finally, they blasted the trumpets and the walls fell, allowing the Israelites to easily conquer the city. So this is an important city, very, very old. In fact, if you go there today, you can see one of the oldest structures on earth. There is a tower there that was built in 8,000 BC, meaning it was 8,000 years old when Jesus was alive. And we've just added 2,000 more years. So it's super old. Okay, so that's the city of Jericho. The other interesting thing about Jericho is that it's the lowest height, the lowest elevation of any city on earth. It's very, very low, which is important detail because remember, when God became man, he lowered himself, meaning from God to human. That's a huge step. It's it's more of a step than from us to becoming a bug. That's a huge step. But he also lowered himself even further by going to Jericho and allowing a human being to baptize him. So that is the setting. Now, we have a lot more details that we're going to talk about with the baptism tomorrow. But for today, my challenge for you is to find a map of Israel. Hopefully it can be one that's in the back of a Bible that shows what Israel looked like when Jesus was alive. But if it's a modern day map, that's fine. I want you to find the city of Jericho and then move your finger over to the Jordan River. And then you will have your finger directly upon the place where John the Baptist baptized Jesus, where the Holy Spirit descended and where God spoke. That's it for Catholic Sprouts today. 
We'll be back tomorrow, but until then, continue to grow in your faith and truly sprout into the beautiful creation that God created you to be. Just one more thing. We are running a really fun sale on our rosary board books and our saint patterns for cross stitch and melty beads. The sale runs through the end of October. So I encourage you to check it out by checking the links in this podcast episode.